Let's begin by queering up South Florida and Florida. Billy Porter leads honorees for Harvey Milk Diversity Honors at Seminole Hard Rock, March 9th. Diversity Honors, an iconic event benefiting the Harvey Milk Foundation and the Pride Center at Equality Park, is set to host an exclusive evening at the Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino on Saturday, March 9th. The lineup of honorees includes the multi-talented Billy Porter, celebrated for his Emmy, Tony, and Grammy award-winning performances, who will be presented with a Harvey Milk Champion medal that evening. Joining him are music icon Belinda Carlisle, recognized for her LGBTQ plus activism, and Native American artist Spencer Battius. Entrepreneur Mark Hunter Seymour will also be honored with the Pride Center at Equality Park Alan Schuber Award. The incredible, beautiful, and just one and only Miss Tatiana Williams and the Gay Men's Chorus of South Florida will also be recognized during the event. Sponsored by the Seminole Hard Rock Hotel and Casino Hollywood, with additional support from platinum sponsor DMK. Dan Montague, uh, I'm sorry, Di Dan Montague King, Diamond Sponsors, Stoli Vodka, and Seminole Coconut Creeks Casino and other sponsors as well. The evening promises a glamorous affair for sure. The Harvey Milk Foundation is one of the world's most important civic civil uh, rights organizations. The ED is Stuart Milk. Guests will enjoy a cocktail reception featuring entertainment by Miss Bouvier, followed by a seated dining experience with musical performances by Debbie Holiday. The festivities will continue with the Stoli Spirit of Change after party poolside at the Guitar Hotel, featuring Stoli espresso martinis, ma uh, marmaids, mermen, and magicians, and more. Tickets for the cocktail chic event are priced at $250 per person and can be reserved at diversityhonors.org. I'm really excited about this gala as well. You know, Diversity Honors is a fun event. I went last year um, and last year they were honoring Chevron Jones and Latrice Royale. They've always got incredible honorees and this year is no different. Belinda Carlisle! <laughs> well, it's interesting because when we had Billy Porter this past fall mm -hmm. at our event, that's when Mr. Milk met him. Oh, really? So, a synergy. It is a synergy. And your event was just so incredible. You know, so we had you had Billy Porter at the venue for Stonewall. And somebody was like, hey, if Stonewall Museum can use Billy Porter, we've got to acknowledge him, too. Right. Well, it's just interesting because Stu Stuart Milk was there and I we introduced them. So I'm very glad to see that this works out for the betterment of our community because Billy is so powerful mm. yeah. and will undoubtedly have an opportunity to speak there when he gets his award. Yeah. And um, he doesn't mince words. And that's a good thing. I, Listen, yeah, right. at your event, right? You, I was like, what is he going to talk about? And you're like, I didn't even give him a script. I just said, hey, talk and do whatever you want. That is how Billy Porter works. Yes. Wow. Wow. I think you could look online to see the speeches at um, at Robert's event. And again, like he says, Billy doesn't mince words. I really look forward to seeing him get this event at the Seminole Hard Rock. I uh, recently saw, uh, I think it was the Go-Go's documentary. Oh, really? Right? <laughs> <laughs> to prepare myself to see Belinda Carlisle, I, unlike Diana Nyad, I am going to stalk her and try to, <laughs> and try to lick her leg. Um, you know, the Gay Men's Chorus gay is being men's honored. Chorus. I love the Gay Men's Chorus, what they do and what they bring to our community and their freaking talent. It's just ridiculous. Um, Tatiana Braxton Williams, I mean, I can sit here and I would take me the whole entire hour to just say all the wonderful things that she does for the trans community, everything that she does for BIPOC community, everything that she does for women in general. Um, and she's also being um, spotlighted as well um, as part of a trans the trans inclusive group and she's just a kick-ass individual so get your tickets today it's going to be an awesome event march 9th it's going to be indoors and outdoors so everybody's going to be a fabulous time and the food is always que rico last week last year i was walking around with scallops in my hand it's all, they were that good it's also important to recognize the hard rock because they donate space and they really make these things so affordable uh, that most of the other venues in the community cannot afford to do. Mm. So that generosity. That uh, spectacular and, venue. But they give it. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, it's they don't charge for it. So it allows ticket prices to be less than when you're in another venue. Wow. Because there we have to pay for the costs of the, of the right. place that we're doing. Right. Yeah. Uh, so they allow these kinds of, they do a few events each year for usually the same organizations mm -hmm. over and over again. 
but that is a really good thing that they do for our community. That's wonderful. I didn't even know that, Robert. And I mean, think about it. That's a big price tag right there is the venue oh, of, yeah. an, of a fundraiser sure at to this is. capacity, you know? Especially so, that, that kind of venue. Well, in Hard Rock, like when you see Hard Rock on an invitation, you're like, yes, I am foo-foo. I'm bougie this evening. I'm going to the Hard Rock. So diversity honors, get your tickets today.